Hello. Hello, Mac. Do you want to? What's chat? going on, Candace? Hello. I, I, and I am very into my shift again, though. You keep coming on as soon as I uh, go I going off duty. I know. I know. I keep trying, and it's uh, bad timing. Um, so mm. you're not available to do it now, then? I mean, I can try and wake up a bit earlier someday if that's more preferable. Uh, I mean, I could do it. We could we could talk now. Are you uh, available now? Yeah, I'm available now. Okay. All right. Uh, yeah, sure. I'm. Are you Mr. Rowe? Yeah, I'm at Mr. Rowe. Okay, I'm here. Cool. All right, cool. Wait, you're here. Where are you? I just pulled in motor pool. Okay, cool. I'm just upstairs. Okay. Wee. Be right there. See you there. Trying to be a bad man, Okay. Um, I'm gonna shut my camera because I mean, my face tells too many stories. So. <laughs> hello. Oh, hello. Hello. Righty, I feel like this is a very long overdue conversation. Yes, absolutely. Hundred percent. All right, you want to start or shall I? <laughs> um, I guess I'll lay some foundation just to make it easier. Um, so from what I understand, um. <clears throat> You're back with it, which is great, yet kind of like, you know, why now? Yeah. You know, we could we could have used a lot of help and feedback when we needed it. it was kind of, you know, I was kind of looking for it and it didn't really get much, even though you probably knew that it was going to be in the uh, certain channels that they were watching and things like that. And I was kind of surprised that there wasn't any feedback from you. Yeah. So then that. now that everything is uh okay, um but now that everything is back in a decent spot, now things are okay again to go back out back out there. So yeah. it's kind of like it felt a little bit like you know yeah. kind of jump ship when we needed it and you're back when it's good. Yeah, yeah. I hundred percent see that perspective. I, I would see it too. It's um uh, I'll try to explain myself. You might, it might not make too much sense, but hopefully it does. Um, so I guess when it all happened, I mean, you know, I got really demotivated from it and really uh, it's just my investment was pretty much ripped from me after. Because at that time, you know, I was trying to do the SRMU. I was putting in hours in and out of the city um, and I like made this whole presentation, did all these notes, was like constantly just trying to always help people with the like trials, was trying to make most of a mm -hmm. better thing as much as I could. And um, and then when it all just kind of got ripped from us with these random SOPs that came out, it very, 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 very much just completely ripped all that from me. And um, and then I was still, you know, like, okay, well, I'll try and give feedback. So we gave feedback in that small, um, like, chat that we had, you know, with, yeah. uh, like, Kyle and, um, like, Roy and, and us. Right, and right, right, yep, yep. And I, I did give, I gave feedback in there. And then, again, they came up with some random SOPs that made no sense and didn't, um, felt really like, didn't take the feedback properly. Yeah, no, didn't I, no, take I any of it. And after that, I was like, well, I just don't think they're going to listen. I mean, maybe it was just my ba bad presumption there. But I honestly... Um, just felt like it, well, it wasn't going to be listened to, and uh, that was. And every time I tried to like write up something, I just kept having that in my head, and it um. It's a private conversation. Uh, yeah, a little bit. Yeah, if you don't mind. Thanks. Thanks. And from there, it was like. It just felt pointless. I, I it felt pointless. And it felt like the only reason that the SOPs have come out now is because the uh, the people who were kind of like writing them and helping write them only rushed to do it now because their bikes are being used again. Uh, that that, And I'm just going to be blunt with you. That's how it felt. And that was the reason why. And that's not saying okay. that like, and I see that it looked like I kind of didn't do anything. Um, which, yeah, it definitely probably I, did I, look like I it. Know, but... I know what you mean. And I felt the same way. Yeah. But, you know, I, so we got it like, Especially like from a supervisory role, yeah. you have to um, kind of like you're, you're you naturally become like a leader of some sort to uh, kind of guide people and show them the way of you know. So like if people you know you, it's demoralizing and demotivating for people mm. if they see their 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 heads kind of given up. That's that's kind of why it was like mm, mm. Uh, a bit of. Um, a bomber but it's a uh, you know i understand where you're coming from but sometimes like when you feel like 
you're losing the war if you don't battle then yeah. you might as well just wave the flag and say well it's it's over now so but you gotta you gotta keep battling to make sure these things come back and back in order and that's why you know this like i wouldn't ask for feedback if i didn't think it was going to be heard and it was months mm -hmm. down the line so or it was a month or two down the line so i yeah. figured it was um uh, just one second no worries um yeah so uh yeah, yeah it's kind of just like you know you, you know what i mean that that's i do so, i do i 100 percent do and um i mean maybe maybe i was looking at it too cynical uh where i just truly didn't think our feedback was really taken um and and the thing is that while this was all happening i was still trying to like showing people through trials and helping people with the bikes when needed i just didn't really want to be for lack of better words, I say use bitch whenever they wanted a bike on like a bike swap or something. Or right, right, 100%. <laughs> you know, because it was just, we'd been thrown about and just put in the dumps, you know? Yeah, um, but the thing is, you have to see where the, you know, the changes are coming from. And yeah. if they think that it's, um, <sighs> Not everybody was had control and they would have gone the same route. So it's like mm. Mal once Malton stepped in and just he, he read all the feedback, all that feedback that was in the channel was heard. So I think we're in a mm. good spot. I mean, regardless, uh, it was more a uh, it, I think we got to the spot where we needed to be and it's not really that bad. But yeah, it's, um, I mean, it's also frustrating it, it, it that just something that like... could be done in two minutes was done in two months. That was also it. That it was just that's it. Just oh, I agree. I mean, really I, I don't, I didn't agree with it in the first place. But you know, I could, yeah, I just if if I gave up, could you imagine? Like no one would have fucking done anything with it. Yeah, we would we'd still be in the same place because no one gave a shit. It was just because I was putting so much into it, and from my perspective, I didn't hear kind of how uh, it was like progressing from it. You know, I didn't hear anything. I just kind of uh, we had like this random SOPs that came in that didn't make any sense, and then it was taking like two months. Didn't seem like anything was being done, so it just. I guess I, I, I mean, yeah, I kind of did give up, but I also at the same time was still trying to help out where I could, you know, like with the physicalities of it, um, and like right. still have people do trials people and all that. Yeah, yeah. Okay. yeah. Yeah, I wasn't going to completely like keep that up. Like, you know, that's my responsibilities. And uh, I do get what you're saying, though. I do. Uh, all right. Well, I mean, I wasn't going to do anything dumb or like anything rash, but I probably am going to bring a couple more uh, supervisors in. Um, mm -hmm. I think uh, Roy mentioned Max. Max, was good. 100%. I, I was about to say the same. Yeah. Uh, Max is good. He might even be already set. I think I saw him in a white livery the other day. And I was also thinking either Monroe or Flop. Yeah, but I mean, honestly, uh, definitely flop. I would say he's really, really good with it. He, uh, I, I did the pursuit trial with him and everything. His pursuit etiquette is really good. He's uh, aware of everything, what to do and what not to yeah, do. Yeah, and he's bike. well documented and too. Like he always very ends well up. Very well documented. Okay. Yeah. Um, and Monroe, yeah, I haven't seen Monroe as much, but he does seem to. I mean, I haven't seen him as much. I probably have to see him a bit more. But yeah, I, he's definitely one that I think I'd put on my, uh, on my mind. Bloom, fuck Bloom. As Candice, fuck Bloom. Okay, yeah, they're both pretty good. I just, I just want more coverage. I want <laughs> people that I can rely on that aren't gonna fuck around to yeah. be able to make sure we don't get back to where we, this whole fucking thing again. You know? Yeah, yeah, yeah. I do agree because that's the thing. It's like it, it was. The, I think our recipes were fine. I just think it was, uh, you know, the way they were used weren't the best. Yeah, yeah, accountability. Well, it's that, and that was that was my major point, and that's why I put in the feedback there. I'm like, honestly, I don't mind. Like personally, I think we go back to where we were and just go heavy on the accountability. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Um, and we need to be that way. Like, if people can't fix their fucking bike before they put it in the like, not even like a full autos repair or something like that. Like, if they can't just hit Benny's before they put it away, then yeah. they're lazy. Yeah, yeah, and yeah. I don't, you know, we don't need that type of person. Yeah. So I don't really give a shit like beyond that. But if that's a very easy thing to like kind of gauge their responsibility levels. Mm -hmm. uh, so I'm I'm at the point where like I'm doing like, you know, we do a warning three day and just removal and 30 day like possible relook. Yeah, sounds good, honestly. You know what I mean? Mm. So yeah. Because we've got it's a lot of people like... with certs now, you know, so it's, it's it's a bit harder to police. Right. Bro. 
Um, but also, I guess uh, another thing to talk about is the SRMU stuff. I don't know if it's been mentioned. Oh, in the fuck? Yeah, yeah, yeah. I saw like the doc. Um, I know you brought that up in the past when we wanted to get the the whole thing going with Angel and getting the presentation and all that shit done. Yeah. Um, you never did send me anything about that. I thought I texted it to you. Did you? I don't know. Mm, maybe I, I didn't but either either way, I, think I, was like that, show you I know the I know you want to run with it, and I'm I'm okay with it. Uh, I think we need more hands on deck though to get that whole thing as a join op instead of oh, a, yeah. just like just taking the whole thing and running with it because yeah. uh, we need we need coverage all around the clock with it. Yeah, well, basically, um, it was I got email to come in um, because bike race has been popping off, and they finally wanted SRMU as a thing. Um, and obviously I was the one that kind of like proposed that and all of that kind of crap. So um, they gave me the green light and they just wanted to double check with like you and Morton to make sure it was still good with you guys. Um, and then from then on, I think my kind of plan going forwards would be write up some SOPs um, and get lots of people's opinions on it, you know? And then, um, and then uh, I'd say delegate uh, and get more people on board with it. I've already asked Max if he'd be um, in interested in it. And he said, yeah, Flop and Monroe are gonna investigate. Um, and then I can try and find a few more people too, but yeah, and I'm thinking it's going to be a bit more of a strict, um, a bit more of a strict like trial or uh, pursuit thing or whatever. We can all talk about that together. Kind of like um, a, a secondary like tier to all of that. All right. Well, yeah. And I then, mean, I, I'm I would say, to, which right. Well, I would SRM say that's issues. probably okay if we had a different vehicle for something like that. Cause yeah. like if. I'm not gonna pull somebody off a fucking race if we have three motor units out and none of them are like street race certed and then having them drop the bike off to get someone who is. Mm -hmm. And then why even have other certs if we're just gonna have, you know, whatever. But I, I would say that's good if we had some other tools besides what we have right yeah. now. I'm so in contact with them. I'm in contact with the mechanics to try and sort that out and see if it would be possible to get brand new bikes. I think new bikes would be preferable or a new, um, well, a tuning of the bike needs to be done anyway. We just need brakes. Uh, yeah, there's, there's like a it's, few things with it. Um, I like, think, I think just things, the brakes but... and a bit more weight on it would be fine. That, that would be good. Because it doesn't, yeah. you know, it, it just doesn't stop. The thing it, stops yeah, like a the, fucking yeah, semi Yeah, the brakes are crap, and going over curbs is an absolute nightmare. <laughs> yeah, I don't know. I think that's kind of a... I, I don't know if that's just our bikes or what, but... I think it is. I've driven a few, uh, like, crim bikes, if you want to call them, and uh, they, okay. they, they they go over curbs like butter. <laughs> it's, okay, all it's right. Well, that's insane. cool. Um, either way. Okay, so that, I mean, I figured it was... That, that, was, that was something I was like, all right, well, if I'm careful around it, whatever, but... Yeah, no, you I still think you can't, just got you just used still to can't it. Maneuver, you can't maneuver with the bikes they got if they're fucking heartbreaking and turning off because it's just there's nothing you can do to stop unless you mm. give them way more distance and then they do a couple turns and you can't even see them. Yeah, yeah, yeah. 100%. So I think brakes, I think brakes are biggest priority. Um, I feel like he's like driven stuff would be nice, but bikes. like you can still kind of work yeah. your way around it knowing that they're there, but. Well, I'll, uh, I'll try and keep working with them and try and get those tuned. And then I'm also, I, I would love to get those extra, at least two SRMU bikes. Um, because we really can't keep up with those S plus bikes very easily. Um, you have to pull out all the stops, you know? Right. Um, you got to get air one or something if you're going to be comfortable on that chase. But yeah, I agree. Um, yeah, I think that's cool. I think we hold the like SRU like qualification. Yeah. Um, first until we get more tools just because we're our availability on bikes and all that stuff like you know interceptor wise they have a lot more out there and they have special class of whatever mm -hmm. and they pretty much all can get on it mm -hmm. so it's not like they they don't really have classes like oh well if you're an interceptor you could definitely be on this chase so it's not like a big deal but um yeah well yeah, it depends we'll, if we have different yeah. class of vehicle, though. i will um write some of that stuff down and see what i can get that makes it fair and everything you know because i okay. think about it a lot back then and i've got like ideas and i've got the siu sops too so i'm just gonna try and kind of mix them up and uh yeah make it uh make it work okay sounds good um and that's cool that so run with that i guess fucking well i don't know we needed some sort of like centralized doc besides like a fucking investigative report we need something where we can 
put information if we're going to go that route. Because right now, if one person's got the folder and they were just reporting all of it to them and, you know, they never see them or something like that, then, you know, we need to have like a centralized place where we can what for the like this. investigation stuff or, or yeah or like the... i mean building profiles of each each racer getting photos yeah they've uh, actually already kinda... got some like flops already been working on it for the past few months yeah um... that document is okay like it's not really it's not really great to i'm thinking we might need some sort of third party or something like that i don't know something outside of the mdw because it doesn't mm -hmm. really do what we need to build profiles for each racer and the teams if there are teams and and things like that so we can't really it, it's okay if we mm -hmm. had an investigative report for each one of them, maybe, but mm -hmm. I just think there's we need a bit more for organization. And I have a couple ideas. Mm -hmm. I, I just gotta, I, I'll, okay. I'll look, I'll, I'll, I'll dig into that a bit more. But yeah, I've, okay. Sounds... I used to do this with like detective work, so it's it's a bit mm -hmm. easier like outside of it. Okay, sounds good, sounds good. And uh, yeah, so I mean, we can all talk about that together and like flop and run row. Um are kind of like meaning the investigative stuff so that should be good so just to confirm then um i can go back to angel and tell her you're kind of you're for it and um yeah, on the conditions we kind of get specific bikes for the unit really mm, yeah at least to like create a subdivision within the department or the within the motor unit yeah just because it's like it doesn't it doesn't we don't have enough tools like three of them are allowed out at a time yeah and one's for trials so those three if two of them aren't you know srmu yeah then that one guy is just going to chase these races around or like you know it's it's kind of i don't understand like how that's the subdivision is going to work really or make yeah. makes sense at the moment well, i'll write some stuff out because i've kind of got it all from before i've kind of got it in my head of how it may work um but i'll write Yo, it I down to try and i want to see it. it yeah write down and then i want to see it too yeah, yeah, hell yeah, yeah. I'll send it over to you once I've done it. Um, and then oh, the other thing is that is that the SRMU will probably be kind of like, you know, so it'll be like under motor, but also under SIU, so it's kind of going to be in the middle um, of both of them. So it, it'll help. Um, I don't understand that. What does that mean? Well, so obviously, like, it could just be like a subdivision of motor, but it also includes SIU too. So it's kind of a subdivision of SIU too at the same time. Okay. So said otherwise. Really? Snow mentioned that we'd be kind of independent from the SRU shit. Hmm. I'll have to double check because Angel actually kept saying something about like it needs to be, they need to know like what, um, like how it's going to work and, and how. I mean, that's fine. I mean, I don't, I don't mind like taking notes from or like feedback from SRU as they have it set yeah, right that's, now. That's so, I mean, that's, thinking. yeah, that's fine in, in terms of guidance, but like in terms of being a subdivision under SRU, I mean, let's be real. Angel doesn't want fucking anything to do with bikes for the most part, unless like they piss her off and then she's just going to spike the entire race. But that's, yeah. I mean, I don't think she's like not gonna help to stop these things, but mm. at the same time, she also doesn't, you know, want much to do with it either. Yeah. Okay. Well, even if it's a subdivision of both or whatever, or it's completely separate, I think either way there'll be feedback from you know Motor and from SRU. So, uh, however way it works, I think it should be fine. Yeah, it's fine. I mean, either way, it doesn't really matter. We're all working on the same shit most of the time, anyway. Yeah. Yeah. Exactly. I'm gonna be honest though. If we're not allowed to go on their races, then why the fuck do we have them on ours? <laughs> Honestly, I mean, we do <laughs> they did say, yeah, we're transport. still. Oh, I did ask that actually. I said, well, what if, um, like, so, okay, so if we do get these special bikes, then are we going to be able to go on car races too? And she said, no. So of course not. Well, I figured, <laughs> I mean, I figured that's she was the reason for that one clause. I'm gonna be honest. I'm pretty sure yeah. she doesn't want us near her fucking forbidden street races. Yeah, too dangerous. Even if sacred, you stay out of the way. I should say her her sacred street races that <laughs> you know we God forbid a motorcyclist near it. Yeah, <laughs> yeah, she doesn't want it. Yeah, well, I mean, I just call it out as I I don't fucking I got at this point I've I'm immune to giving a fuck. Yeah, yeah, I feel that honestly. I've kind of got to that point too. Um, uh, yeah, that's cool. But I'm glad right, we well, I'm glad we cleared the error. Yeah, I, me too. I I just you know I wanted I haven't caught caught you in a while, mm -hmm. and I just you know I figured I heard you were getting back active again. I'm like, well, that's nice. I'm glad you're yeah. back, but you know it's I could have used you in the middle there, but 
Yeah, I see what they're saying. Uh, I do, yeah. I mean, I have I mean, my you're the first one I gave the and... fucking thing to. Yeah. The the whole enforcer role and creating the role, you were the, literally the first one I went with. Yeah. It's because I tried so hard for it, and then it felt like it would throw it away, you know? I, just... Hey, fucking, <laughs> why they got named names on a motorcycle? Me. You think I'm fucking, I was happy with that? <laughs> no, true, true. I literally, I had, if I gave that up, I would have fucking, no one would have trusted the unit anymore. Mm-hmm. All right, well, anyway, keep, yeah, keep your eyes. Let me know how, you, how things are going. If you need feedback, yes. just, you know, hit me up. Okay, I will do, I will do. Okay, cool. All right, good luck with that. Thank you. I'll see you later. I'm going 42. All right, have a good one. Oh, my God, I just caught him. I literally just caught him. Let me quickly call Spartan back. I'm going to have to restart my game. Something's wrong with it.